video. This weekend I thought I would vlog because we are going on a little trip away, staycation, because we're still in the pandemic, so we're just going to the Peak District for a couple of nights to explore, walk, do all the rambling things. And yeah, we're gonna bring it along, so keep watching. We just had some packed lunch in the car because we had some bread left at home so we just made some sandwiches and now we're heading to the gardens and pavilions and the weather is actually nice it was meant to be raining all weekend but it's sunny and quite warm so that's good We're heading into town now to get something to drink. There's a lovely park behind us. Can't see it because of the trees, but it's really nice, believe me. And you'll probably see some more shots of it later. our hotel and we got a bit soaked on the way here it was so sunny and nice and then suddenly it started raining so yeah that's where we are so i'll just show you around the room it's a four star hotel with a b and b vibe it's, it's pretty nice we've got the lake view here we're gonna chill for a bit dry ourselves and head out to have some tea and more drinks
we are back at the hotel room now. We had some Thai food for our tea and before that we had a few drinks. So I didn't feel much between the drinks and the tea. But we're back in the room now and I'll see you tomorrow. It is day two of our little trip. We've just had breakfast and so we'll be heading down to the pool's caverns for an explore. We booked a tour there and then we're gonna go outdoors and we've got a few places on our list to visit where we can go for a walk and there's some nice landscapes to see. So yeah, we'll bring you along again. We decided to walk towards the caverns and Solomon's temple because it's only like a 10 minute walk from the hotel. So there's no point taking the car out and we can explore more. There's always more you see and notice when you walk. So that's what we're doing. amazing now the sun is out and it's, it was meant to be raining all weekend but it's dry we've just been to the caverns it was definitely worth it really interesting in the very last chamber at the end of the tour we were 30 meters below ground it was freezing in there though my hands are still like white from the cold white and purple so we're now heading to town to get some lunch i think we're going to greg's i fancy a nice baguette from greg's we're just walking past the pavilion gardens now Lovely. Moments later. So we ended up driving to Matlock and we want to get on the cable card and go to the peak. What was what is it called? Abram Heights. Abram's Heights? Abraham's Heights or Abram's Heights? Anyway, it's a cable card from Matlock. It goes to this peak and on the peak. Uh, you've got a little town. We came here last year in August actually to do that but the town was absolutely packed. It was full. It was such a hot day and there were so many people. We couldn't even get into this car park to go there. So we just walked around and went somewhere else. But now it's, it's pretty quiet. I mean there's still a lot of people about but it's nowhere near as bad as last time.
the fossil house which had some exhibitions about the history of this place and also a selection of fossils and a little gift shop obviously and now we're at the highest viewpoint so there's the platform and here's the view so I'll walk up there now this was a good climb this to get to this platform We are back at the hotel room now. It started raining as we were about to come down from the hills of Abraham, so I didn't film anything else. So on our way back from Matlock, we stopped at Bakewell and got some Bakewell tarts. So that was the only reason why we stopped there. So we've been there before actually. It's a really lovely, historic, like charming town. And it's just great to walk around and explore. But we just stopped to get some tarts. And yeah, it's still raining. It looks like it's not gonna stop now. So we're just going to chill here, have the tarts, and then we're heading out for a pop tea tonight. So we've got a round tart from Bakewell, and then a square tart from Bakewell as well. so thanks for watching and thank you especially if you made it all the way to the end of this video so on the last day today we just had a breakfast at the hotel and head straight home it was raining and there was two places indoors that we wanted to go to but the tickets were sold out so we just came home and i can have a slow chilled day today before going back to work let me know in the comments below if you've been to the peak district and what is your favorite town or where would you like to visit it would be interesting to have a little chat with you guys and don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss any of my new videos and hopefully i'll see you in the next one Thank you.